This is a product video for the Master Appliance Pro Heat STC Heat Gun, and here are the details. STC stands for Surface Temperature Control, the 1600 series is 120 volts, the 2600 series 230 volts. PH 1600 and 2600 has a 6 foot cord, the PH 1615 and 2615 has a 16 foot cord. Minimum output temperature is 170 degrees Fahrenheit, or 80 Celsius. Maximum output temperature 1000 degrees Fahrenheit, or 540 Celsius. It comes with a built-in infrared sensor on the front of the heat gun and an LCD screen on the back of the heat gun, as well as a ProLock supervisor key that can adjust and lock the settings. The ProHeat STC has a cushioned ergonomic handle that is easy to grip and a plastic guard that protects the hand and prevents the trigger from being accidentally turned on. The trigger turns the heat gun on and off and has a lock button for continuous use. The laser targeting system is built in at the front which determines the surface temperature and regulates the output. On the top is a hang loop and on the back of the ProHeat STC is the control center. To turn the heat gun on, simply press the trigger. The blue knob on the left controls the fan output. The lowest air velocity setting is 734 FPM and the maximum setting is 4000 FPM. The red knob on the right controls the temperature setting. The minimum temperature is 170 degrees Fahrenheit and the maximum can be set at 1000. There are three sensors below the two knobs that control a variety of unique functions on the ProHeat STC. The ProLock Supervisor key is used to activate the sensors. The sensor on the right side switches the readout from Fahrenheit to Celsius and vice versa. The knobs can be set at a specific temperature and fan outputs to adapt to different scenarios. The ProLock Supervisor key can be used on the left sensor to lock the settings in place. This prevents accidental temperature changes during an install and ensures steady workflow. To take out of lock mode, simply activate the sensor with the ProLock Supervisor key and make necessary adjustments. The middle sensor switches the ProHeat STC from nozzle temperature control to surface temperature control. The laser pointer can be seen on the surface. When the ProHeat STC is 4 inches away from the surface, the two laser points will become one. When pulled back to 5 inches, the dots will separate above the center of the nozzle, and when it's 3 inches away from the surface, the dots will separate below the nozzle. The numbers on the bottom of the screen show the surface temperature, and the LED light in the middle will be green when the set temperature is too low, yellow when close, and red when it is exactly where it should be. When the post-heating temperature is set, it can be locked in by activating the sensor on the left. With the automatic surface temperature control feature of the ProHeat STC, the heat and fan settings will automatically adjust. This means that even if the heat gun is too close or is stationary, the temperature of the surface will never exceed the set temperature. With post-heating complete, the ProHeat STC can be switched back to nozzle control setting and normal heat gun use can be resumed. And now, here are the specific install features and functions of the ProHeat STC heat gun. The longer built-in cord allows installers to skip connecting the heat gun to an extension cord, which can often become disconnected during the install. For removals, the ProHeat STC can be set on maximum temperature and fan settings. This will heat up the raft film thoroughly in a short amount of time, as well as helps lower removal times, reduce adhesive residue left behind, and minimize tension put on the application surface. For extended use, like on removals, the trigger can be locked into position, which reduces the amount of grip and focus needed on the heat gun. ProHeat STC is very lightweight, which means less fatigue and higher comfort of use. With the dial in variable temperature and airflow controls, it's easy to change the output settings in order to adjust to different applications or scenarios within a normal workday. Here, the surface is dried at one setting, then it was adjusted again as the ProHeat STC is now warming the wrap film so it can be conformed into a deep recessed area. By adjusting the heat and fan settings, the risk of overheating the film goes down and a high workflow is maintained. Warming the area in circular movements helps even out the heat and relax the film quicker. With the wrap film formed into the recessed area, the ProHeat STC can now be switched to the surface temperature control setting. With the specific temperature set and locked in, the only thing the installer has to pay attention to is keeping the light red. If the light is red, it means go ahead. If it's green or yellow, slow down. For large sections where the wrap film has to be heated, the ProHeat STC can be adjusted for a high fan output. This will help heat the wrap film quickly so it can be conformed in a timely manner. Instead of going by the readings on the LCD screen, for normal install usage, seeing the wrinkles of the wrap film relax indicates that the film can conform to the application surface. Taking the time to thoroughly heat the wrap film, especially for multi-layered wrap films like Chrome, can help lower install times and assure quality, especially on recessed areas. When installing, the heat gun will not be in continuous use and instead be turned on and off. Regardless, the ProHeat STC heat gun reaches the output settings both with heat and airflow quickly. This means that the installer doesn't have to leave the heat gun on continuously, which can lower the lifespan of the heat gun and lead to high electric bills. 
The long cord also allows for high mobility during install, which means the installer can have solid workflow and focus. The ability to set and lock exact post heating temperatures that automatically adjust means no stress, particularly for owners and beginner installers. There is simply no chance of accidentally burning the wrap film or substrate. This feature also frees up a hand during the post heating process. This allows installers to multitask during this time, which can help with customer relations or communication within a shop. One highly recommended tip is to set the ProLock Supervisor key on a carabiner and attach it to a tool belt or work pants. This makes it easy to access and less prone to misplacing it. When the work is done, the ProLock Magnetic key can be set in a tool cabinet for safekeeping until the next day. Another tip is that when done using the ProHeat SCC at the end of the day, be sure to place it upright for a few minutes to cool down. Once cooled down, be sure to place it in a safe location in order to avoid any accidental damage. This will help ensure that it's long lasting and high quality for use day in and day out. The ProHeat SCC comes with a one year warranty and more information can be found on Facebook or at the Master Appliance website. On the website, click on products, then scroll down to the surface temperature control heat guns. Click on this link and here you'll find a wide variety of important information on the ProHeat STC heat gun, including product videos, additional attachments, features, reviews, and support materials. For questions or additional information, the Contact Us button can be clicked on. Here you can submit your personal information and request, and a Master Appliance representative will contact you shortly. This has been a product video for the Master Appliance ProHeat STC heat gun. Proudly produced by the Rep Institute.